Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you a few different ways you can pack for your vacation. So if you are new to my channel, welcome. Be sure to click on the subscribe button down below and the notification bell in the corner to be notified every time I upload a new video. So for the packing, I'm going to be using miniature outfits and accessories so everything can be more organized to give you ideas as to how you can pack for your next holiday or trip. So let's go ahead and take a look at the first style of packing. So the first style of packing we have here is for a summer vacation. So there's a total of four different types of t-shirts here. Three of them are casual shirts, while the fourth one is a tank top. The top shirts have graphic designs on them. One of them says NAS on it, and the other one features a unicorn, while the other two t-shirts are a lovely purple color with really pretty designs on them. And just in case if it does get a little bit colder, we have two long sleeve shirts here. The first one is a really bright purple color with a lovely star design in the middle, and the second shirt is a very bright green color, and that has a graphic design on the side. Another item I'll be packing away just in case if it gets a little bit colder is a jacket. It's a lovely bright red color, and it's very thin and lightweight, so it's perfect for traveling around. Here we have two pairs of PJs and they're both themed to space. So the first one is a tank top and matching short set and it says Space Dreamer on the front. And the other PJ set here is a t-shirt and legging set and it says to the moon and back on the shirt. And the star design on the leggings definitely match the space theme of both PJ sets. A summer vacation wouldn't be complete without a swimsuit. There's a total of two swimsuit sets here. There is a one piece that's red, white, and blue. And then we also have a swim shirt with some matching swim shorts. Let's go ahead and take a look at the pants, leggings, and shorts. So we have a pair of casual denim shorts here that will go great with the t-shirt and the tank top that I showed earlier. And then we also have some space themed leggings as well and they're blue and purple and there's a star design on the front and back. Here we have some jeans and pants. The jeans are light blue color and there's also some pants. They're a light gray color and there's some polka dots and a star on the side. So here we have three pairs of shoes. So the first pair are meant to be for casual outfits. Then we also have some sneakers. And as for the last pair, they're flip flops for the swimsuits. Now that we've organized the outfits and the shoes, let's move right along to accessories. So one of the most important items you need when traveling would definitely have to be a toiletry bag. And that just has some of the general items like toothbrush, toothpaste. And then we also have some soap, shampoo, and conditioner. And that's all in the small bag. And then we also have some sunglasses and a document holder holding all of the different documents you need when traveling. So here we have a few more extra accessory items. So first off, there's a neck pillow and that's really great from traveling to and from the destination. And then there's also a swim towel and that'll be perfect for the pool. It's a bright red color and there's a star design on the front. And here we have the suitcase and the backpack used for this particular trip. The suitcase itself is a really bright blue color and I love the holographic design on the backpack itself. And here we have an overview of all of the items that will be needed for the summer vacation. So let's go ahead and move right along to the next style of packing. So the next vacation or holiday we'll be packing for is a road trip and more accessories and items we featured in this packing style compared to the first one as I'll be showing you different items that you can bring on a road trip. I'll be showing you two different ways to style and pack for a road trip. So let's go ahead and organize the first suitcase. Let's go ahead and take a look at outfits first. So we have a total of two different dress styles, a casual dress and a fancy dress. So the casual dress is the zebra stripe dress with the bow on the side, and the fancy dress is the blue floral dress with the bow design in the middle. And up next, we have a casual outfit and a PJ set. So the casual outfit says Aloha Hawaii on it, and there's also a pair of jeans to match that. And as for the PJ set, it is penguin themed. It has the number 10 on the shirt, and there's penguins on the leggings. And here we have a total of two pairs of shoes, and since the casual pair of shoes will be worn while on the road trip, we'll only need to pack two away. One for the fancy dress, and there's some flip-flops for the swimsuit too. And the next item we have here is the swimsuit. It is a two-piece, and there's a really pretty floral design on it, and it's so bright and colorful, definitely perfect for the summertime. And then we also have this dress cover-up as well. It's a bright pink color, and there's a floral design on the side to match the swimsuit itself. And here we have a few items, not for the road trip itself, but more for when you arrive at the destination, whether that's at a pool or at a beach. So first off, we have a hat. There's a blue flower towards the side, and it's perfect for when it's hot and sunny. And then we also have this bag, which turns into a swim towel. It's perfect for traveling. And one item that you can definitely use while on the road trip are a pair of reading glasses. Here we have some items that would be perfect for a road trip. There is a reading book, an activity book, and a magazine as well. Another item that would be really great for a road trip would be some sort of electronic device. So here we have a laptop. There's a dragonfly design on both the laptop cover and the laptop bag too. 
And then here we have a toiletry bag. It just has general items like soap, shampoo, conditioner. There is a toothbrush, toothpaste, and hair ties as well. And then right next to that, there's a blanket. So now that we've organized all of the outfits and accessories for the first bag, let's go ahead and pack the suitcase and the backpack away. So we have all of the outfits here in a pile, and all I need to do is pack the backpack. Now let's go ahead and organize the second suitcase and backpack. So we have a total of two dress options here, a casual dress and a fancy dress. The casual dress is the purple one and I love the design of it. And as for the fancy dress, it's the pink purple one with the sequins on the side. And here we have a casual outfit and a PJ set right next to each other. So the casual outfit features gray polka dot pants and a purple shirt and there's a really nice star design in the middle of that. And as for the PJ set right next to that, it is all purple again and there's a lovely design on the shirt itself. So here we have two pairs of shoes, so the casual shoes will be worn on the road trip itself, but we have a pair of flip flops for the swimsuit and then we also have some fancy shoes for the fancy dress. And here we have the swimsuit and a swim dress. So first off, we have the swimsuit itself. There's blue ruffles on it, and it features some purple designs on the front, and there's some beads towards the side. And as for the item next to it, it is a swim dress, so it's perfect for visiting the beach or the pool, and that's a bright red color. A few items that you'll need for the destination itself and not for the actual road trip is a hat and it's white and green. We also have some sunglasses that are purple and a beach towel that's a light blue color. Up next we have a few travel items, so there is an eye mask, it says wish on the front, and then there's also a neck pillow and that has some polka dots on it. And the third item here is a toiletry bag. Here we have some activity items for the road trip itself, so first off there's a tablet, it's really great and perfect for traveling because there's a cover at the front of it so it won't get damaged. We also have a magazine, and the third item we have here is a reading book. And for the road trip itself we have a blanket here and a pillow too. Now that we've organized the outfit, shoes, and accessories, let's go ahead and take a look at the suitcase and the backpack. So the suitcase here is a lovely purple color and there's a design on the side. I've just added all the outfits here in a pile and then here we have the backpack itself. And now that we've organized and packed away the second backpack and suitcase, let's go ahead and sort out some general accessory items you normally bring on a road trip. So the first general accessory item we have here is a picnic blanket. There's a really lovely floral design on it, but it's perfect if you want to have a meal or a snack either at the beach or at the park. Up next we have a camera here, so you're able to take photos so you have memories of the trip itself. But of course if you have some sort of device like a phone or an iPod, you can take photos using that. And then some sort of board game or card game would be really great as well. So here we have two examples, a classic deck of cards, and then we also have a game of apples to apples. And along with classic board games and card games, we also have some outdoor games here. So we have, for example, a soccer ball, but you could definitely add in a basketball, a football, or a frisbee. And then we also have a game of bouquet here too. So now it's time to go ahead and pack away all of those items in the activity bag. So now everything is all packed away and ready to go for the road trip. And the next vacation we'll be packing for is a cruise and I'll be showing you two different ways you can style and pack your suitcase and your backpack. So let's go ahead and style the first suitcase. So here we have the items for the first suitcase. There are a total of two casual outfits here. The first outfit is a long sleeve shirt and a pair of shorts. And then the second outfit we have here is a classic t-shirt with a matching skirt. Here we have some more casual outfits, definitely perfect for a beach vacation and also for a hot summer's day. So we have a tank top and shorts combination and the floral design on the pants are so pretty. And we also have two dress options here as well. One is a bright blue color and the other one has a zebra design on it. And the next two outfits here are more formal. There's a dress and there's also a shirt and skirt combination and they both have a pink theme to them. And there are a total of two PJ sets. One is a light blue color and there's a really pretty floral design on it while the other one is a long sleeve shirt and short set. And just in case if it gets a little bit colder, we have a vest and a jacket. So the vest here will be a great addition with any of the outfits that we packed away. And as for the jacket itself, it's very lightweight so it's great to travel with and it's a bright pink color and there's a hoodie attached to it too. This vacation wouldn't be complete without some swimsuits and there's a total of two different styles and options here. So the first one is a two-piece and it has a floral design on it and the second one has a swim shirt and shorts. There are a total of four different shoe options for the outfit. So the fancy shoes are actually the boots towards the side and there's some glitter on them and then we also have some casual shoes, some sandals and they can also be used for the formal outfit as well and some flip-flops as well. 
Up next, there are some hat options. So the pink one is styled more like a baseball cap and there's a star design on the side. And then the other hat we have over here is plain white and there's a flower design on the front. These items are more for traveling. So there's an eye mask and a neck pillow. So here we have a few more items. There's a notebook. There's also a travel journal to write down all the different experiences and memories. There's a pen as well and a passport too. Up next, we have a magazine and a reading book, and the reading book is Rebecca on Sunnybrook Farm. One item that you need to pack away for any vacation is a toiletry bag, so it has all of the essentials inside, and then we also have some hair ties and hair accessories too. Here we have a few more items for the beach and pool. So first off, there's a beach towel, and this towel is really great for traveling because there are some straps so it's able to stay in place. And then we have some sunglasses with a sunglasses case as well. There is some sunscreen and there's some binoculars. So here we have some bags for the trip itself. So there's a suitcase, there's also a backpack which has a lovely star design on it, and then also this small purse, and that'll be great for visiting the beach or pool and carrying a few small accessories. Let's go ahead and organize the second suitcase and backpack option. So here we have two casual outfits. There's a t-shirt and jeans set. The t-shirt says Aloha Hawaii on it. And then we also have a dress option as well. And that has flamingos on it. It's perfect for the summertime and great for hot weather too. Here we have some more casual outfits, so there's two dress options and there's a romper as well. The dress is a bright green color and I love the tropical design on the top there. And then we have this dress and that has a purple design on it and the romper is so great for the beach or pool. There's some buttons on the front and there's a stripe design on it. Here we have some PJ sets, there's a total of two and they're all themed to the color blue. So the first PJ set has a floral design on it and it is a tank top and legging set. And the second PJ set is a t-shirt and legging set and that's themed to a dog. Up next we have some swimsuits. So the first swimsuit option is a two piece and there's polka dots and stripes on it and there's a zipper on the top. And as for the second swimsuit option, it is a one piece with a floral design on it and it comes with some matching shorts as well. And just in case if it gets a little bit colder, we have a sweater and a jacket as well. So the jacket is a jean jacket with a hoodie on the top and the sleeves match the hoodie. And then we also have this sweater and it has some stripes on the front. There are a total of four pairs of shoes. So there are some pink floral flip flops. There's also some casual sandals. And then there's two fancier shoes. One of the shoes are green and the other ones are silver. So now that we've organized the outfits and the shoes, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the accessories. So we have a reading book here, and it is The Wizard of Oz, and then we also have a magazine as well. And up next, we have some perfect items for traveling. So there's an eye mask and a neck pillow, and it comes in a matching set. They're all bright green with pink polka dots on them. There are a total of two hat options here. So there's one style like a baseball cap and it's themed to New York. It's a dark blue color. And then the other hat option is bright red and that's more of a wide brim hat. Let's go ahead and take a look at some more activity items. So there's a travel journal, there's a notebook and it has a zigzag design on the front. There's a pencil and a passport as well. And up next we have a bright pink toiletry bag with some toiletry items inside. Here we have a few more items. So there's a beach towel and that's a bright purple color. There's also some sunscreen and I love how the sunglasses match the beach towel and there's a carry case for those as well. There's also a watch and some binoculars too. And here we have some bug spray and a camera but what's really great about this camera in particular is that it's an underwater camera. And here we have some examples of different card games and board games that you could pack away for vacation. So there's a Rubik's Cube here, there's also a deck of cards, there's Uno, and there's a game of tic-tac-toe as well. And here we have some bags. So there's a blue suitcase, there's also a pastel-themed backpack, and a small little purse, and that's definitely perfect for carrying smaller accessories to the beach or the pool. So now that we've organized all of the outfits and accessories for that trip, let's move right along to the next one. So before we sort out all of the accessories and shoes, let's go ahead and pick out the outfits. So here we have the dress box, and I'll be going through the different dress options to see which one suits best. So the dress that I'm looking for to pack away would be something suited to the beach or the pool, and something for the summertime as well. All of these dress options are so pretty, and they all have a lovely pastel theme to them, but they're all quite fancy and formal. But this dress I think would be suited for the vacation. It's a lovely blue color, and it has a floral design on it. I also love the bright green design on it, so we'll go ahead and add that to the suitcase. 
And the next box that we have here is the t-shirt box and there are quite a few different options here. There are some fancy tops and some that are more casual. So I need a total of two different t-shirts, one more for the beach and the other one more as a casual shirt. So this t-shirt is definitely perfect for the beach or the pool. It's a bright yellow color and there's a bead design on the top. And the ruffles are so lovely on the shirt. So let's go ahead and try and find a casual shirt. There are quite a few different ones to take a look at here. The purple one is really pretty and so are these ones as well. But I'm hoping to find one that doesn't have a graphic design on it. This one has a sewn on floral design at the front. And I think this will go great with a pair of shorts. And the next box we have here are all themed to shorts. A lot of the shorts within the box itself are casual. So that's perfect for the outfit that we're looking for. So I know a particular pair of shorts that I want to pack away and I think these are it. So they're plain white but there's a design on the bottom and they'll go great with the items that I've already picked up. And I'm also hoping to pack away two more pairs of shorts. So one of the shorts I'm looking for are just a casual pair of denim shorts as they'll go great with any item. So here we have these ones. They're very lightweight so they're perfect for traveling. And then let's go ahead and look for the third pair of shorts. The yellow tank top that I ended up picking earlier actually came in an outfit set with a blue and pink floral pair of shorts. So I'm going to try and find those and we can pack those away. So here they are. They're perfect for a summer vacation and I think it'll go great with that outfit. So let's move them out of the way. So the next box we have here is the sweater box and it's perfect for when it gets a little bit colder. So I'm going to try and find the right option so we're able to pack that away too. I'm trying to find something that's very thin and lightweight so it'll be easy to pack away so none of these sweaters on the top here will work as they're quite thick and more suited to colder weather even though these sweaters are so lovely and pretty but I think this one over here will be very suited to the trip. It's orange striped and it's very thin too. And they'll go great with these shorts that I've already packed away. That outfit is so perfect for a vacation. So the next box we have here has different cardigans and some more sweaters and jackets as well. But since we already have a jacket, we won't need to worry about that. But I'm trying to find a cardigan that would be suited for a formal outfit. I think the cardigan over here would be definitely perfect for a formal dress. It is so pretty. It's a lovely pink color. It's very thin and lightweight, so it's easy to pack away while traveling. And I have a t-shirt box here, not because I'm looking for a t-shirt, but I'm looking for a t-shirt jacket option, which I think will be really great to be packed away for this particular trip. So I'm going to try and find it. It has a hoodie and a floral design on it, and it's perfect for summer weather as it doesn't have sleeves. It also comes with a matching skirt option, so we'll have to look for that too. And the skirt matches the green that's on the hoodie. So let's go ahead and look for the skirt that matches the t-shirt hoodie that we just added to the packing pile. It's green with the polka dot design. It's so pretty and it's definitely perfect for summer weather. Here it is. So let's go ahead and add it with the rest of the clothing items. The last set of clothing items that we'll need to pack away are PJs and I'll be packing away a total of two pairs. One that's more for winter weather and one that's more for summer weather. I think it's really great to pack away both options because you never know what the weather is like. So here we have the winter option and I just need to look for the summer style. So this here is the summer option. It is a shorts and a long sleeve shirt style. It's so pretty. It has a fox on it. And then as for the winter option, it has butterflies on it and it is a long sleeve shirt with pants. So let's go ahead and take a look at the shoes. So the first pair of shoes we have here are some blue and orange sandals. And up next we have some more sandals but they are styled quite differently. They're orange, green, and yellow. These shoes are really great because they can be used for a casual outfit or something that's a little bit more fancy and there's a floral design on the side. These sandals will definitely go great with a few of the dress options that I picked out at the start. They're green and I love the design on the front. And the next item we have here is a toiletry bag. And this bag has quite a few different accessory items including a diary, a laptop, and a phone as well. Here we have two more items, a reading book and a camera. And what's really great about this travel bag is that I'm able to organize and sort out different outfits and accessories. So right in the middle here, these compartments will be really great for shoes and I'll be adding in each pair of shoe to each compartment. And the two pockets over in this section of the travel bag will be really great for outfits. So over in the smaller pocket, I'll be placing the two pairs of PJs and as for the larger pocket, I'll be adding in the rest of the outfits I'll be packing away. And now all I'm doing right now is folding and packing away all of the different outfit options and everything seems to fit in the pocket. 
And now that everything is all packed away, all the different outfits, shoes, and accessories, it's time to go ahead and close the bag. And what's really great about the bag is that it completely zips up and it has all the different pockets and items so nothing will fall out. And then we have some handles as well so it's easy to carry around as well. So I hope showing you different styles of packing depending on what trip you were going on helped you to pack for the next time you go on a vacation or holiday and it also definitely depends on what vacation you're going on as to how many outfits, shoes, and accessories you can bring. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I really hope you guys enjoyed it.